Hello! This video is for instructors looking to submit midterm progress or final grades in Faculty Center. Let's get started. First, log in to My CSULB Faculty Center. Check that your teaching schedule is set to the correct term. If you need to change the term, select the Change Term button in the upper right corner of the screen. Next, choose the class to grade by selecting the blue grade roster icon located to the left of the class listing. Look for the Display Options panel to select your preferred grade roster type. Use the drop-down menu to select Midterm Progress or Final Grades. Remember, Midterm Progress grades are optional, but a great tool to help your students understand their progress in your class. You may enter midterm grades towards the middle of a semester. Grades are not considered final until they are posted officially to a student's record at the end of the semester. Whether working with midterm or final grades, you can set up grades in Canvas and use the Import Grades button located in the LMS Grade Import panel to autofill your roster. You also have the option to enter a grade for each student using the table below. Use the drop-down menu in the Roster Grade column for each student to select a grade. Save frequently to avoid losing your work. To bulk assign the same grade to multiple students, check the boxes on the left next to each student. Next, select a grade in the drop-down menu below your roster and click on the Add This Grade to the Selected Students button. When it comes to final grades at the end of the semester, there are some special grading circumstances to keep in mind, including withdrawals and incompletes. Students who have officially withdrawn will have a W or WE grade already assigned. However, if a student stopped participating in your class but did not officially withdraw, you will be able to assign an unauthorized withdrawal or a WU final grade. When you select Unauthorized Withdraw, a new field will appear for you to enter the date the student last attended. Another circumstance is an incomplete. Students who are unable to complete all assigned work, have completed at least 66% of the class requirements, and have unforeseen but justified reasons for not completing the class work may be eligible to receive an incomplete, or I, final grade. If you assign an incomplete grade to a student, you will need to complete an incomplete agreement for the student. Select the I grade in the drop-down menu and select Save. A new link to Add Agreement will appear in that row. You will need to create an agreement to submit your final grades for your class. Once you are finished assigning all grades for your class, whether midterm progress or final, select the Save button to start the approval process. A pop-up window will appear to notify you that further action is required. Select OK. In the Approval Status drop-down menu, select Approved. A pop-up window will appear confirming that you have successfully submitted your grades. Grades will be available for students to see in their MyCSULB Student Center the next business day, between 8 a.m. and 9 a.m. For more information about grades, visit the Enrollment Services website and explore faculty and staff resources. The Faculty Center Teaching Schedule page provides instructions for entering midterm grades, final grades, creating incomplete agreements, and submitting change of grade requests. Additionally, the Understanding Grades and Grading page provides details about final grade policies and procedures. Thanks for watching and go beach.